Hey, Alan here, Folding English Outfitters. You know, a couple of years ago in 2020, Springfield Armory started marketing a bolt action rifle. Now, they've always been known for their M1As, AR 15 types, semi automatic pistols, stuff like that, right? Well, their bolt action, pretty nice gun, called the 2020, and specifically they called it the Waypoint. Made in center fire calibers, a very nice modern bolt action rifle with uh, all the modern features that you've come to expect from these things. Well, new for 2023, we have the 2020 Rimfire. The lead off examples are 22 long rifle caliber, that's what this one is. Bolt action, 22. Nothing terribly remarkable about that. Uh, the action reminds you a little bit of the Ruger American series, and it's going to compete with that probably, and with some other things too. First examples we've seen have been black composite target type stocks like this, and then a green composite target type stock, same configuration. And then they also have some very nice walnut stocks. Now these guns are made by Rite, R-E-T-A-Y, Rite, over in Turkey for Springfield Armory to their specification. The walnut stock guns, the lower grade ones, are actually quite nice. Uh, most likely Turkish walnut, which is pretty good, tends to be a little darker than the European walnut. You know, if you've ever seen that, that tends to be a little reddish. Uh, Turkish walnut tends to look a little more like American walnut. It has a little darker tinge to it. Uh, this gun doesn't come with iron sights. It does come with a Picatinny rail that's interrupted, which gives it a nice aesthetic look around the, around the bolt, besides clearing the bolt so that you have no problems with ejection. And it's got a threaded front muzzle, standard half by 28, so you can put suppressors on it and that sort of thing. Smart idea on their part. It uses the Ruger 1022 pattern magazine. Comes with one that just has Springfield's Armory's logo on the bottom of it. Should work standard with regular 1022 mags, which of course are available in 15 and 25 round uh, flavors if you need more ammunition. This type of rifle is probably going to work best with a 10 rounder because most likely you're going to shoot this from a bench or some sort of supported position. Bolt is really smooth. Nothing, nothing spectacular about it, but very smooth. We just put an inexpensive scope on top of this one just to warm it up, try it out a little bit. Accuracy is fine from what we could see. Does come with an accuracy guarantee. The guarantee is with a competent shooter, three rounds under one inch at 50 yards. Now, that may not sound like a whole lot, but, you know, I've seen 22s that would not do that. So, uh, at least they're giving you an accuracy guarantee to a point. And I suspect that with the right kind of rest and a good shooter and right ammunition, this rifle's probably going to exceed that. And there'll be some more shooting that we'll do with this to kind of flesh that out a little bit. We did shoot it both with and without a suppressor. It's a 22 rifle. It's a bolt action, and everything you've come from expect from that type of weapon, that's what it is. Comfortable to shoot, of course. The synthetic stock is heavier than the wood. The synthetic stock is specifically built up a little bit back here to give you a good cheek well, well with a, uh, a higher magnification scope, perhaps. The Springfield 2020 Rimfire, pretty nice gun. It's it's an interesting entry for them into the market. There are a lot of bolt action 22s out there today and a lot of people shoot them. They're fun, they're accurate, they're inexpensive to shoot and all those things make them attractive to a lot of people. Price point's not bad on this. We're just starting to see them. So as always, call, check with us for current price and availability. But uh, we think it's gonna be a pretty nice product. So. Uh, that's what we have for right now. Thank you for watching. We appreciate it. Uh, we'll see you next time. I'm Alan for Old English Outfitters.